as individuals, we, we're all trying to cope with this personal blurring of boundaries between professional life, personal life, uh, how they relate to each other. Sometimes they're aligned, sometimes they're not aligned. And the, for, for many people, this is very challenging. You know, we can't necessarily clock in and clock out and live different lives as, as easily as we have in the past. So I think that th there will continue to be organizations that um, in some ways demand you know, or ex you know, expect and really demand a, this slicing between who we are and the role that we play at work. Uh, unfortunately, those organizations probably won't disappear. They will be disadvantaged. We will see more and more opportunities for people to live integrated lives in terms of their work, in terms of their, uh, who they feel they are, what they want to achieve, the impact that they have on the world, and that that is fully integrated into who they are at work and the way in which they work in their organizations. Um, increasingly, the more talented people are the ones who are going to be able to find roles where they, which enable this integration. Uh, unfortunately, there probably still will be many jobs which, where we have the separation. And uh, you know, I think those organizations will be less successful, but they're not going to disappear overnight. And we will still have this increasingly segmented society, I think, between those who are more able to follow their passion and those who are struggling with that uh, clash between their work lives and, and who they feel they are.